快走！我Sure you get it, Phantom Thieves. Let's go. Yes. Nice cover! <laughs> 
won't miss. <laughs> them out. Oh! 
whip them into shape. What to do here? My turn.
Wipe them out. Nice position. Let's You'll be well hit. Quick. A direct hit! Bug, you're on a roll! Finally over. At least for now. Toshiro! And... Irina? Hmm? Hey, guys. Uh, I'm glad we won and all, but... What the hell just happened? Yes, we could use some help getting caught up. In that case, I'll explain what I can. Granted, I only understand so much. Did something come back to you? Yeah. I was made from Toshiro's heart. No, technically I'm more like a manifestation of his heart. For some reason, human cognition can lead to the physical materialization of their own heart in the metaverse. Shadows, personas, cognitive beings, all these originate within the human heart. But in your case, Despite checking all the boxes, you aren't exactly any of those. Hmm. But, but she definitely seemed to be Toshiro's persona a second ago. And now she's back to the arena we know, through and through. I admit, I have no idea how relevant your past experience is to my own situation. But what I do know is, I serve as the core of Toshiro's heart. My reason for existence is to protect it. Protected from who, exactly? Marie and... Mm. No, I think it's actually something more powerful. We don't know his true identity, but he's been awfully dedicated to torturing me in particular. And I believe he's someone who especially didn't want me awakening to my power. Whoa, what's that? No, this is... <laughs> what the hell is going on now? Oh crap! Weapons at the ready! Let's go! from <laughs> 
throwing themselves into the inferno of war. Oh, damn it! Would you just speak English? You're not making any sense. If comprehension eludes you, then so be it. My protection is of a unilateral nature to begin with anyways. Accordingly, I have no intention of crossing arms with you in the first place. You said your name was Samael, right? Tell us, what made you decide to come down now? Given all the trouble you went through to break down Toshiro's heart behind the scenes. The fact that you're showing yourself now tells me something. We messed up your plans, didn't we? Had to come see it for yourself. Silence, you tainted child of calamity and war. I won't deny the children that I have been tasked to protect are on the brink of strength and vindiction. Therefore, allow me to shepherd you to your salvation. I implore you to accept my convocation of peace. That means the power you just obtained is a massive madness, one which will assuredly drive man. I shall make it so. In doing so, you would be relieved of the tragic memories you experienced here and return to the life you know. So you're saying if Toshiro-san abandons the power of his awakened persona, you'll get rid of his memories of this world and send him back to the real one? Indeed. Furthermore, my offer is not limited to him. The path of salvation is an invitation I extend to all of you. Though you may be infidels who have the audacity to defy a god, I trust this world has been edified. Here you witness the folly of running into the flames of battle, brandishing nothing but discordant values. You're... Now, you needn't be hasty. The intoxication of a fleeting victory has clouded your senses. I shall be waiting to hear your true verdict at a different venue. Hey, who said you could just... Uh? send us back to the real world, right? Yep, I'd say that was the gist. Real generous of you, buddy. I know what it said was ridiculous, but I can't deny the feats it's pulled off so far. I'm not sure what exactly it is, but I think its power is the real deal. That's awfully pessimistic of you, Arena. I guess that's true. Maybe I am feeling some uneasiness. According to Salmael, I'm the reason this whole thing happened in the first place. Not that I think everything it said was true, but I won't say I wasn't bothered by it either. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah? Koshiro, I'm trying to be serious here. I'm just saying, meeting the head honcho seems to have made you unusually meek. But hey, perhaps you intend to accept his gracious offer of salvation? No. That's not what I... If you have a goal you believe in, then you keep moving forward. Even if it means knowing you'll get hurt. That's what you and everyone else taught me. Well, sounds like Toshiro has decided on his answer. That's right. It'll take more than a bit of lecturing to make us have a change of heart. I agree. I don't see salvation as throwing away everything we've done so far either. If we were willing to settle for a deal like that, wouldn't be the Phantom Thieves. I don't think that's changed since we came to this world. In fact, I think we're even more firm in our resolve now. Honestly, I don't quite understand the nature of this new power I've awakened. The one thing I'm certain of is that you're the physical manifestation of the courage inside me. And nothing some egotistical god says is going to change that. Oh, Shiro. You're right. Thanks. Hey, way to go, Toshiro! What'd you learn to talk the talk, huh? But I 
think we have our decision now, don't you think? Okie dokie, time to wrap this thing up, leader. Joker, I couldn't have made it this far without you. Your confidence means the world to me. So, will you fight until the end? Thank you. Hell yeah! Time to fry up this salmon jerkwad! Wait, how are we even gonna reach the thing? Um, up? That doesn't really help us. Is that a train? Everyone? <laughs>